Hi guys, what's going on? Welcome to another video. I'm here to bring you the world bosses are just spawning now. You have the Innismon boss spawning in 8 minutes 52 seconds. We have the Astalat bosses, they're all spawning in 8 minutes-ish. Um, luckily enough, I actually managed to get into this zone early enough that I could get in, check what's going on. And I just want to go for a little lap around Innismon to show you what is going on right now. The crazy stuff that is here. Um... It's just amazing. I'm so happy to see this. Like this, this to me is the game being alive. Um, there is actually a cap on how many people can enter the zone, um, and that's just stop like huge amounts of lag. But right now, the 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 load, the the zone load is already filled. We've still got a couple of minutes to go, so I'm just gonna run around show you guys what it was like trying to uh, get into the Ennismon groups. It's just insane. It is crazy what is going on. It's amazing to see, though. Um, but, yeah. So, for those interested, I was actually planning on doing a video about this tonight because I was going to plan on killing it. Doesn't look like I'm going to be killing it anytime soon. So, uh, yeah. We basically have three bosses. Just sort of give a bit of an example as to what they are, what they do. Um, you have the Innismon boss, which drops the... Let's just show you, shall we? Uh, which drops the... Uh, sacred bone marrow used to upgrade the tier 5 swift claw mount into the rage claw uh, i'm going to be doing a video on mounts very soon uh, it was supposed to be today it is going to come out over the next couple of days um does have a lovely a pretty cool ability on it um the spectral mask is from camlan uh, so obviously T7 is going to be a lot harder to kill today. A lot of people don't have T7 Reaver yet. It's going to be a lot a lot of competition there as well. I think bigger groups are even going to be there. Um, and then the final one, Astalite, is the Demon Prince. And the Demon Prince drops the Infernal Horseshoes. Uh, all three of these rare mounts have uh, special abilities. Uh, so I'm just going to carry on running around and show you guys what it's like right now. As you can see, looking at the minimap down here, just look at how insane that is. How many people there are around. Look at all of this. This is this is a living community and it's really cool to see. Even though I know that I'm not going to be able to compete for any Mon, And that kind of sucks. It's so cool to see this cluster this mayhem look at this right now it's just insane uh, so i can't go too deep because i will get dropped immediately um but it's just insane as to what's going on right now and uh really really cool to see um so yeah these bosses spawn once a week um they drop a load of runes souls artifacts uh there's rumors that they're going to be dropping different things in the future potentially things like raid artifacts could come from them that's something that's been speculated upon however not confirmed yet uh so yeah i mean they're really really good if you can lock them down there's going to be a lot of comments to this i can already see it coming of people being like oh yeah but that just makes it a zerg game and Yes, this is a raid, this is Zerg content, this is where an alliance comes in handy. Um, the people in my group currently, shout out to those guys, they're all from Tetra. Uh, really interesting, really cool to see that we managed to get a group together and we're going to go and compete for this. But ultimately right now, it is also the first one. Later on in a month or so time, there'll be a little bit less competition for this. But right now, this is just madness. So, uh, guys... Tell me if you managed to get into the, any of these madness groups. If you managed to kill the boss at all, please let me know. Tell me the experience. Um, at some point or another, I do plan on actually killing these bosses. Releasing full guides as to how to kill them, what they do, tactics, all this stuff. Um, plan on doing the same thing with the resource guardians as well. Hope you like this video. Sure, it's been, sorry, it's been a bit of a short one. Um, Albion World News is coming as well. So, yeah. Hope you've enjoyed this and catch you later, guys. Goodbye.